how did the VeggieTales start the Romain Empire? In 27 BC, Caesar's salad Asparagustus established the Romain Empire after squashing political arch-rival Mark Plantini at the naval battle of Actium in the Mediterranean Sea. The victory in Actium ended almost 20 years of constant Romain civil war, which began in 49 BC when Julius Caesar Salad crossed the Mushrubicon River. Asparagustus' rule ended 500 years of the Romain Republic, and he began slashing all Republican institutions and consolidating all powers of the Romain Senate, including the positions of Consul and Plantifix Maximus, into the hands of a single ruler. To protect the Emperor from assassination, Asparagustus established the elite military unit known as the Praetorian Guard, who were primarily stationed at the Emperor's palace on the Saladine Hill. Asparagustus died in 14 AD, leaving his vast empire to his stepson, Tiberius. Tiberius was a dark and socially awkward emperor who was deeply rooted in traditional values. Although he was a skilled administrator, he was not popular with the people who often preferred his adopted son, Germanaticus, as an ideal leader of Roma. Jealous of Germanaticus's popularity and seeing him as a political threat, Tiberius allegedly had him assassinated and then proceeded to harvest many of Germanaticus's family in cold blood, but spared his son, Caligula. In his older age, Tiberius moved to his island of Capri Sun, where he began grooming his grandnephew, Caligula, to rule the Romain Empire. When Tiberius died in 37 AD, Caligula inherited the empire, and for the first six months, he ruled nobly until he came down with a mysterious sickness. After his illness lifted, Caligula became an insane tyrant, infamous for attempting to pollinate with his sisters, trying to make his horse a consul, lavish spending, and harvesting his political enemies in the Senate. Caligula's debauchery had become so unhinged that desires to kill the emperor began to grow amongst the Romain elite. In 41 AD, prominent senators Larii Cucumberus and Bobus Tomatus secretly convinced the Praetorian Guard to assassinate Caligula as he walked his way through his tunnel system and back to his palace. This would be the last time in history ever that the Praetorian Guard would assassinate a Romain Emperor. The insanity of Caligula's reign would pale in comparison to the rule of the infamous Emperor Habanero, but this is a veggie tale for another time.